Yo, what is going on guys? My name is Michael or Rising Hero. Welcome to a brand new YouTube video. Today guys, we're going to be going over some new information that just came out today on Borderlands 3. And um, if that excites you, consider joining the channel by subscribing and leaving a like on this video. That'd be very appreciated. Other than that guys, let's jump right into some information that just came out today by one of my favorite YouTubers named Sabato. And uh, he just gave us some new information that from his anonymous sources. And um, let's just jump right into it. So Zero will be returning, okay? Moxie will be back and she will be behind the bar at Sanctuary 3. Ellie will be back and she will be helping us fix vehicles and getting us off Pandora. Or preparing us to get off Pandora in the beginning, okay? So I've, I think I've, I haven't stated this before, but... In the beginning, when you start Borderlands 3, now this is leaked, alright, anything is subject to change, but you are bound to get off Pandora. You're not going to be there for too long, but I don't know too much information on the story, but we just know that we're going to be going to different planets, okay? Um, but she will be helping us get off the planet, and she'll be prepping us and stuff. But, um, <clears throat> and she'll be at the lower levels of Sanctuary, th Sanctuary 3. Now, Crazy Earl will be back. I'm pretty sure he's going to be handling, like, the Moonstones and all that. Like, where you buy backpack spaces and all that cool jazz with, like, those little cool collectibles that you use for currency. I don't know too much about it, but Tannis will be returning. That was already confirmed by the many teases that Gearbox was having us or giving to us. Um, Zero will be returning and will be helping us fight al alongside the battle in, in Borderlands 3, just like how we did in Tales from the Borderlands. But um, other than that, maybe we get some new lore on him. Maybe his new secrets on who he really is. Because I know Tannis knows who he is. But as of that, that's pretty much it. We don't even know if he's female or he's male. I don't know. One of the planets that we will be traveling to is called Eden 6. And it's not new. But there's some new information that came up on one of the enemies that can can be found and that is called a Jaggermon and a Jaggermon can climb and use weapons and they will be found on they'll be one of the enemies found on Eden 6 and here's what we'll be getting and here's some new interesting things on Flak okay so Flak will be able to use a tamed version of a Jabbermon as one of his beasts so right now we have what the spider ant the rack and the skag I think uh, all of those, so yeah, his Jabberon will have a tiki style mask and long bushy tail. At the end of his tail, he has spikes. He can use weapons, climb, and hang on stuff. So, Rack will still have a spider ant, skag, and rack, but the spider ant and rack will be in a combo. Now, here's an update on Amara she's a dark skin siren and she's inspired by an indian goddess okay so i might have made a little bit of a mistake and i apologize uh, when i made my amara video from what um uh, Sabato described she was a dark skinned like I, i'm not yeah she was dark skinned i still got some credit on it so i apologize if i didn't misinform any of you guys but she's gonna be like dark skinned indian kind of color no not to be racist or anything but i apologize for that but um, she's inspired by an Indian goddess. One of her skills shows of her multiple with it shows her with multiple extra siren arms like this uh, Indian goddess named Kali, the one you're seeing on screen. She's dark skin and uh, she is pretty ripped. That's all the information I have so far that we've gotten today. I, I'm sorry if I stuttered or anything. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. But if you guys did, by any chance, please drop a like. It really would help out the channel. But other than that, guys, hope you guys have a great day. Peace out.